I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. My dad, he hates psychics. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level. I trace the psychic interference back to Coach Oleander's radio. Is this a nightmare? Or a plan? Or both? Hey, hey, welcome back. We're doing some more Psychonauts. It's been a little while, but who's keeping track? Either way, um, I guess the only way to go from here is to continue. So onward, my friends. So, last I recall, we needed to go see Mia. Let's climb the ladder, baby. Where's my map? I forgot how to play this game, but that's what happens when you don't load up the game for two months at a time. Here's our map. Oh, that's right, the controls are inverted. Find him yet? Well, I tracked Dogen into the forest, but his footprints just disappeared. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, and I tried to tag Elka, but she punched me. I saw Milka run into this cave, so all I have to do now is wait. Why don't you just run in there? Never follow a snake into its hole, Raz. That's the code of the mongoose. The code of the hunter. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> Alright, I need to find that secret entrance thing. Here it is. Bam! Oh, it's just a slide right in there. Let's go to yeah. In recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility, I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for Pyrokinesis. <laughs> yeah, baby! Mental agility. That's what I mean. in the circus uh, but why would you want to burn all these happy memories here if they were happy memories i wouldn't have run away my dad he hates psychics and he knew i was becoming one so all day long he would force me to practice my acrobatics hoping to distract me or maybe hoping to kill me i never was sure now why are you still talking when you could be burning stuff <laughs> great great <laughs> now come on now just look at something and then use your you're getting warmer Keep going. Ooh, it's getting hot in here. You have to promise me, only use your power, pyrokinesis only, when it's very, very important. Or it's really, really entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> Hell and if yeah. you're doing it to impress girls, make sure none of them have on a lot of hairspray. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Where would you like? Nowhere. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. Pop in any time, sir. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Dogen, are you okay? I had the strangest machine-induced dream about you. TV? Well, first of all, Sasha Nine invited me down to his secret lab, and... TV? <laughs> was completely brainless. <laughs> the dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know where your brains are. They're in <laughs> what? Like this crazy dream thorn bush straight jacket tower place. Aggie sack. You go to the TV lounge. I'm on the case. I just need a little more advanced training to prepare. Hey, Elton, have you heard anything else about that thing in the lake? Huh? Oh, not really. The fish are kind of going crazy about Bobby and Benny over there torturing anything that swims too close. <laughs> oh, somebody should do something. Yeah. What the fuck? Well, oh, I, I forgot about that. You can just talk. do this shit, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Swimming, is that a thing? Yeah. Only one way to find out, I suppose. Okay, so it's something like that. Check oh, it out, Admiral. I'm an oarsman, first class. Hey, it looks like all those weeks in the canoe simulator really paid off. <laughs> uh, yes, sir, Admiral, sir. <laughs> well, it, it, let's get you afloat. Finest of the fleet. I'll take good care of her, sir. That lake isn't as peaceful or as harmless as she looks. <laughs> now, don't take her out too far. <laughs> There 
there she is. And there you All are, right. darling. Tell the Don't worry. This time, I got baby. in contact with your father, and he's going to be here tomorrow to pick you up. My father? Oh, gotta go. The race is starting. Lily! Oh, hey, Raz. Listen, I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but... They stole Dogen's brains! No, he's just like that. <laughs> I had a nightmare where this mad scientist guy said he was gonna take them out, and... Was it a creepy-looking freak with a shower cap and a stainless steel three-pronged claw? Hey, that's my nightmare. So it's not just me. But how? And why all the meat? I don't know, <laughs> but I think it's time I find out the where meat. this is coming from. That should have Let's not worked the way it did. That should have been one briefing. underwater this is girl. So cool. <laughs> yeah, it feels like that time in True Psychic Tales 314 where. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> I just love that that's how they navigate on the canoe, too. <laughs> Agent Vodello? I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. I've already done the coach's obstacle course, and Sasha showed me how to shoot. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Orso, but Sasha? Agent 9 said you were the most powerful levitator the Psychonauts had. Sasha said that? Really? <laughs> I didn't know he noticed. Well, you know, I only work with the best teachers. <laughs> okay, let's party. <laughs> All right, easy enough. Scene. Agent Vodello? Oh, hell yeah. Where are you? On TV, of course. Where I was always meant to be. <laughs> and look at my hair, darling. How can hair this fabulous not be on TV? That's now, darling, nice the best way to learn levitation is to just try it. I'm going to give you a levitation learner's permit. It will only work while you're in my mind. After you finish <laughs> my course, I'll give you the real thing, baby. First, you gotta show me you know how to use it. Left. Okay. Now bounce on up here and follow me, darling. There you go. Nice. Now for this last one, you're really gonna have to fly. Once you get up in the air, try using your thoughts as a balloon to float. Oh. Yeah. All right, I'm getting the hang of this. Oh, Okay, yes, now, I am quite outstanding. Thank you for noticing. Come find me on the other side of the party, and I'll give you that merit badge for real. Never keep a girl waiting long, young man. You don't have to tell me twice. Let's do this. Stay on the ball in here, Rasputin, if you want to get higher. And see if you can get all those rings spinning, Mr. DJ. Oh, there's little uh, pigments. Oh, damn. You are the sugar in my bowl, darling. Now just follow the flowers, won't you? And try to stay rolling at all times. That is the theme of this party. You know, for being a game that came out in 2005, like, controls are not that bad. Fantastic! What style do you have, young man? <laughs> Here we go. Just like this. Yeah. Thank you, sweetie. I feel so much better now. See that draft up above, darling? Jump into it and float and see where it takes you. Yeah. Nice. Okay. All right. Is this the up? It is the up. Owie. Oh, give me that. Let's crack open that safe. Come on. Stop moving. Yeah. Let's peek inside. All right. Okay. Hmm. 
<laughs> oh shit! It us with a glob. Oh my goodness, I'm having a hard time right now, fellas. Where am I supposed to be going? Oh! Wow! You can climb the chain link fence! Who would have thunk? Sometimes this answer is a lot easier than you expect it to be. When you are levitating, you are also protected from all sorts of icky things. But some... Hmm, that shouldn't be happening. Darling, do you have some problems with water? Do you want to talk about it? Uh, it's a long story. Maybe <laughs> later. Okay, I'm always here for you, darling. Let me just say that it's very normal for boys your age. I am that psycho not. Beat stupid Bobby Zilch in the Leviathan levitation race. I can read, clearly. Okay, it's time to see how fast you are, darling. Ready? Get set? Go, baby! I'm fast go. as fuck. Oh, seriously? Well, that just might have fucked me over. Alright, well, I suppose I can do this whole thing again. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's time to see. Ready? Get set? Go, baby! There we go. You did it! You are quick like greasy lightning! I'm so proud greasy of you! Greasy lightning is, so is uh, a way, way to go, I no suppose. Time, eh? If you float in some areas, you might get a little more oomph than usual. What we got here? smack a -row. <sighs> Oh! Now you're going to have to use your side float again to get those rings spinning. Time to get lifted. Yeah. Was that the right way to do it? Was it the wrong way to do it? Hell yeah. Go on. What is that? All emotional baggage sorted. Nice. Oops. I'll get the hang of this eventually. I will. I suppose. No! Damn it! I've got it figured out now. I can't believe I was having a hard time with this for a second. Damn it! What? Oh my. Okay. Who's that I see? Maybe it would help it's if I actually Putin, talk to her. The rolling rock star in the flesh. And just in time, the party was dying without you, darling. Here, I have a little party favor for you. Yeah, baby! That's what I'm talking about. So cute. Don't be a stranger, darling. Thank you, Agent Vodello. Now it's back to the lab to save Dogen. Dogen's not in the lab, sweetie. He's watching TV in the lodge with the other children. I meant the dream Dogen from my brain tumbler vision. If I can find out what's happening to him, maybe that would give me a clue about who stole real Dogen's brain. Oh, I'm afraid he's just like that. <laughs> All right then. Well, glad to know that uh, everybody's on on the same page. What? Pardon me? <laughs> the water beckons. You have a water phobia? <gasps> me too. Huh? No. Well, yes. I just. I mean, my family has this problem with water. It's a bunch of hooey anyway. Some old gypsy curse about how we're all supposed to die in water. If you can believe that. Oh, I thought it was about the whole thing with the brain-eating fish that walks out of the lake at night to hunt for victims. <laughs> well, see ya! <laughs> um, hey Raz, I saw you and Lily talking in the coach's class, and I was wondering... 
Were you asking her to go with you? What? No! I'm here to train. No distractions. Excellent. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> In recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility, yeah. I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for telekinesis. That's fucking awesome. Okay. With telekinesis, we can use our minds to grasp an object and then throw it. Hmm. Let's see if you can make it through the hoop. You sound like my dad. <laughs> yeah, I've been thinking about that. Why'd that guy hate psychics so much? What do we ever do to him? Well, psychics killed his whole family. Cursed them and all their descendants to die in water. Whoa. Yeah. Well, that's... Talk about <laughs> baggage. <laughs> Tell me about it. And the weird thing is, I'm pretty sure he's actually psychic himself. Ha! Huh. Cuckoo! Well, you can work on him when you get home, <laughs> for now. Oops! Pick that trash can up and aim your toss at the side of the caravan. The caravan side, Einstein! Kablooey! Throwing something against a wall is a little more destructive than tossing it around on the ground, isn't it? Bullseye! Looks like the trash took him out. <laughs> <laughs> Next lesson, we'll work on your snappy one-liners. <laughs> ah, that's right. I need to go to the, the brain tumbler at Sasha Nines. Yes, yes, let's go. All right, Nine, let's do this. Okay, I'm a certified limitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm. I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, which explains many of the strange things you've seen. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? <laughs> Hold on. Hold on just a sec. Man. Yes. Mental cobwebs getting you down. I've got just the device up here in the main large store. Why oh, hey, look at that. Oh, you can grab shit with the telekinesis. Who would have thought that that's what telekinesis would let you do? All right. Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Because if you lit it and held it up right now, that would be rad <laughs> and completely insensitive to me and my issues. Oh, right, right. Oh, never mind. I forgot about the whole fire bad thing for a moment. No. Excuse me. I told you the burgers ain't ready. But no, you didn't. The coals ain't hot. They're not gonna be done for a while. And maybe a week. A week? They're back. <laughs> I'm the only one back here. These things take December? Time. I don't even want a hamburger. Oh well, why didn't you say so? Only Sixteen so, days in a month? What do you want? Oh, that's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind with you. Now with that, oh, that's my last cobweb. Eight hundred. Take that into someone's mind with you. You can clean. Now with that, you can change the color of some of your psi powers. Ah, now here's something every young psi cadet needs. Now that dowsing rod will help you find arrowheads that are buried deep. That's where all the really valuable ones are, you know. Find three or four deep deposits, and that baby pays for itself. It costs you money because it makes you money. Now, you take that psi core there, put it together with nine psi cards, and you'll have yourself a brand new psi challenge marker, which is worth a whole rank, you know. Mmm, dream fluffs. Delicious, nutritious, and cheap. Each one is packed with concentrated mental health. You shouldn't go anywhere without a pocket full of those. A <laughs> dream flood. Now, All right, let's get this dowsing rod. Alrighty then. 
thousand grind can be used to find deeper, more valuable Citanium Arrowheads. Equip the dowsing rod and watch and listen to its changing color and sound. This is how it lets you know that you are getting close to a deep arrowhead. Okay. My perfect fitting! Read! TV! Hacky sack! Yes! Hacky sack! <laughs> oh no! They're all brainless! Hi, Raz. <laughs> Vernon! You're okay! Yeah, we're great. Me and my pals Kitty and Frankie are just hanging out telling stories and watching the boob tube. TV! Vernon, look at them. They're zombies. It did seem kind of weird when they let me get this close to them. And then they didn't <laughs> mind when I talked all through the show. Kitty even agreed to go on a date with me, more or less. We're gonna play hacky sack. Keep an eye on them, Vernon. I'm gonna go figure out what's <laughs> causing this. Roger that, Raz. Did you ladies know what a... Dogen! TV? Yeah, good idea. You rest here while I find your brains. <laughs> yup, it's true. It happened back when this place was still an Indian summer now. cap and burial so ground. Nice A group of Eugen soldiers got separated from their regiment. Night was falling, and they were cold and scared of Dracula. Boo! <laughs> um, I'm kidding. They were just terrified of getting shot. Though I'm sure any of them with any sense were afraid of Dracula too. They stumbled across an old building. You could still see it on the far side of the lake. So they decided to spend the night there. Little did they know, it was an abandoned Indian insane asylum built on a caveman burial ground. Yup. Little did they also know that a cursed fish lived in the asylum and that he was an escaped lunatic but from a different asylum. So even though he was actually living in an asylum, he was still counted as escaped. And what was his curse, you ask? Where his gills should have been, he had hooks. Yup, and where one of the hooks should have been, he had a lug. Yup, a lug. And instead of being about 14 inches long, he was 10 feet tall. But that wasn't the scariest thing. The scariest thing, the absolute scariest thing, and the thing that still makes the old timer's blood turn to ice, and vice versa, is the part I said first about how he had hooks for gills. Oh, brr. Uh, anybody need a hug? Anybody? See you in hell. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, Raz? Didn't Why is your head a taco? We're just looking at the sunset. Shh. Just wait until he leaves. Okay. Send me back in. Hmm. I've been running some tests. The thoughts of some other empires. Can't get a good grip. Here we go. Now that's big brain thinking right there. Now how do we get in? Oh, it's right there. Why are you screaming? <laughs> All right, I remember. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, that oh was easy. good boy. <laughs> There's that pesky brain. Here's a tissue. Now, don't you feel better, my dear lad? TV? Of course! Right here! And this bad too. We'll just drop it in the old garbage chute. <laughs> now, don't <laughs> chew solid foods for six hours! Lily! Down the garbage chute, huh? <laughs> Hit it. 
<laughs> what the fuck? Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool as hell. All right. Hmm. I need to think about this for a moment. Man, I am so smart. Soft a lot in this underbelly? Here I come. Yeah, okay. Looks like I was just kind of missing the mark a little bit. No big deal. that brain, baby. Whoa! Okay, it's not over. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Yes! Let's go. Is this a nightmare? <laughs> or a plan? Or That's both? That's fucking crazy. Wait a minute. Oh shit. It was behind the curtain. Mutant, I'm sorry. I had to abort the experiment. Something unbelievably urgent has come up and I must leave immediately. I know! You'll never believe- Hold that thought. In a rush. Official Psychonaut's business. Wait! So is this! Official Psychonaut, hey? <laughs> you forgot your- Hmm. Hey, that white room. I know. It's from Oleander's mind. I think I was in the coach's dream that whole time. Ever since I stepped through the static in the caravan, it felt funny. I knew I wasn't obsessed with meat. <laughs> and was stealing psychic brains to arm a fleet of deadly tanks, apparently. I've got to tell Lily. She's waiting for me down by the boathouse. Down by the... water? Uh-oh. Better hurry. Mental cobwebs getting you down. I've got just the device up here in the main large store. Punch yeah. on up and score you. Yeah. This is way easier than I thought it would be. Bobby! Uh-oh. Look, I can explain. Keep <laughs> Sounds like you caught a bad cold. Maybe. But listen, I traced the psychic interference back to Coach Oleander's radio. He's been broadcasting his insane plot all over camp in his sleep. So he's really kidnapping children and stealing their brains to make weapons. Yes. Isn't that great? What? <laughs> How is that great? Because this is an honest-to-goodness psychic emergency! And Sasha's not here. He left on some official psychonauts business. Mia left a note saying the same thing! Lily, a deranged man-man is building an army of psychic death tanks to take over the world. And there's no one who can stop him, except for you and me! Oh my god! Let's make out! <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just so excited. Since you showed up, Raz, things are so much more exciting. What the fuck? Sinister death plots, mad scientists, hideous monsters. Make out? How long have I <laughs> what this camp had to offer? 
Everything's new to me now, thanks to you. I mean, look at this flower. You mean, like, kiss? How many years have <laughs> I been coming here, and I've never even noticed a cool flower like this before? Jeez! Oh, uh, oh, no! You didn't just hit my boyfriend! <laughs> What? <laughs> she was surprisingly collected in that situation. I can't. I can't swim. Well, then use the bathysphere at the end of the dock. Quick! While the flipper prints are still glowing. Are you coming? I don't know how to drive that thing. Uh, I can't. I have to, um, uh, check on the other children. Yes, yes. If the brains are out, they'll need supervision. And possibly refrigeration. And how can you not know how to operate a bathysphere? Haven't you ever been to a summer camp before? I'll get a move on before <laughs> that girl gets overly digested. Okay. <laughs> Water level. Ah, tax. Nails? I guess that didn't help. Man! Man! This is kind of an interesting looking place. Kind of a little shipwreck here. Oh shit. That's the uh, Alright, maybe it's not a shipwreck. Maybe it's <laughs> something else entirely. Yeah, get out here. Okay! Cough up the girl and no one gets hurt, fish! <laughs> Man, it's gonna be hard to find a new place to give you lumps. <laughs> oh, okay. Can't get a good grip. Can't get a good grip. Watch it. Haha! <laughs> That'll do it. All right, <laughs> that's kind of a cool little thing. <laughs> this is kind of awesome. Smash the coral to bits! Hit the clams! Shut your mouth! Okay, I'm getting stuck. I'm stuck! Yep. <laughs> I love how it's just a psychic karate chop. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> that lobster got fucked up. Holy shit, how big is this place? Like, why doesn't it just get rid of all the water? Or, or get rid of the A, rather. Okay, let's see. Can't get a good grip. Can't get a good grip. Jump inside someone's head. For the good of the mission. Oh, nice. Okay, there we go. Cool. That's all I needed to learn. How did he do it before? Watch it. Oh, come on. 
Nice, okay. okay. I think I know how to do this. Yeah, there we go. Bam! Big brain thinking clearly. Ah, oh, poor little thing. That poor little thing just tried to kill me about eight different ways. <laughs> well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus lined air bubble beneath a semi dry leg bed. But judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Oh, poor little thing. Yeah, go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters? Oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. Now get in there! Alright. Let's go inside the mind of the fish. Hell yeah. <laughs> ah, top of the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives <laughs> followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. <laughs> ah! Oh, go, go, <laughs> All right. Well, should I call it there? Maybe. I think this is a good place to call it. All right. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.